Hey, uh, you know, Marysville is one of the few communities actually holding a public fireworks display this year. It's the only one in Snohomish County. And as COVID cases are spiking here, health officials are hoping they don't see infection skyrocket. The show is going on in Marysville. Last year's 4th of July celebration was the first in a century. It was so successful, leaders almost immediately planned to do it again. Then coronavirus hit. We know that this year is a really different 4th of July, and we aren't going to be able to do it the way that everybody is used to. And this year, officials are moving the fireworks to the city's waterfront with much more restricted access. It closes at dusk, so people won't be able to gather to watch the show. Officials hope people will watch from their yards, or if they do venture out, to stay in their cars. Part of the reason the show is going on is it's already been planned and paid for, but COVID case rates in Snohomish County have doubled just since June, leading the county's top health official to warn we are in a very precarious situation. Is this a responsible thing to do? Our leadership talked about it for quite a while, and this was the decision. Um, we have had a few people complain to us that they thought it was irresponsible, but you know we can't control everyone's behavior. You can take a lot of other things as examples such as wearing a mask or something. You know, we can just ask people to be responsible and that's where we are. San Juan Island is putting on a public display as well, but only for locals. People other than Islanders are simply not invited. While the 4th of July is the biggest day of the year in Friday Harbor and money is desperately needed, tourism officials say it just isn't safe to allow people in. Regardless, you'd have a tough time getting up there on a ferry. We're on the winter schedule still, so it's very limited boats. Um, the ferry schedule, if you were going to come for the day, it leaves before the fireworks start. So we're just trying to do something nice for the community and just leave it at that. Back here in Marysville, the city actually paid for fireworks that will go about 100 feet higher in the air so that uh, people can see them from farther away. And we're also told that there will be police down along the waterfront, gently nudging people along, making sure that they don't congregate. We're live in Marysville tonight. Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.